Is that all? Certainly, welcome back to the channel. Keith here from Command the Hoop Celtic. If this is your first time coming across the channel, please hit that subscribe button below. Thumbs up or a comment below on the video would be fantastic. I have to wear the Love Street jersey today. On this day in 1986, Celtic clinched the title against St. Mirren. And a massive thanks to Albert Kidd as well, scoring two goals against Hearts on the final day of the season. Up and done day to break Jambo's Hearts. But okay, let's talk about it today. Jota. Celtic permanent deal. It looks like it's getting closer and closer. A news tabloid in Portugal have broke the news this morning that Jota has told Benfica and the new manager Roger Schmidt that he wants to stay at Celtic. Celtic have triggered the fee of six point five million pounds, which is seven point three million euros, to sign Jota on a permanent basis. Now there is a loophole with this deal. A source of mine has told me that Jota is looking for €45,000 per week. Our highest player is Callum McGregor at the club on €45,000 per week. I don't know if this is going to go through. I'm not trying to put everyone's hopes up, but if he's looking for that type of money and we're going into the Champions League next season, we're one victory away from the Champions League football. Obviously, we can meet him some way. Even give him 30000 If he's not accepting that, I'm sorry. We can go out to the market and get someone that wants to fight for the short. I know he's been happy at Celtic. 12 goals, 12 assists, 37 appearances. He did go off the radar for a while when he got injured. Before Christmas, he came back. In the last two weeks, he's been outstanding. Thought he was outstanding against Ross County. You thought he was outstanding against Rangers, and we're starting to see a really good player. I've said this on the channel many a times. He's the best left winger we've had since Scott Sinclair. So, are Celtic going to be ambitious? Get this guy, as I said. 6.5 million is the bid that's been put forward on the table and we have fourth priority as well he could go back to benfica see if he's part of roger smith's plans try break into the fourth team try get some champions league football next season as far as i know benfica were toured in the portuguese league when i last checked i know they had a good run this season in the champions league but obviously liverpool beat them well let's see what happens carter vickers is the same situation as reports that Carter Vickers is on £56,000 a week at Tottenham and he's not willing to cut his, pay, cut his wages to stay at Celtic on a permanent basis. There's been reports of Fulham, Southampton, they're the latest clubs that have been linked with him as well. West Ham have been linked to him, Crystal Palace, Wolves, Leicester. There's going to be a variety of clubs in the English Premier League looking at Carter Vickers because he's been so consistent this season. So let me know what you think of a Jota. If he doesn't take the pay cut, we can go somewhere else and get someone else, you know. So let's see what happens. Speak to us all soon. God bless. Hell, hell.